Hey there, my friends. Welcome to um, a yard sale haul. I haven't had one for a while. It's just been too, too hot to go yard sailing. And, um, but today, today is also going to be a hot day, so this was my only yard sale stop of the day. Um, but it was a good one. It was a very, very good one because I have um, quite a bit. <laughs> I have a bag of VHS and cassette tapes in here we will go through that i'm not sure what everything is but we'll find out together oh, all right and then i have this bag of dvds yeah what bag is this naturalfactors.com okay yeah, okay, so we have that to go through. Um, I paid $20 for everything. It was a, a charity art sale. Uh, I think $20 was a really good price. And, you know, when it's for charity, you don't care, forking over a little bit extra, right? So, and what I got, believe me, what I got is worth more than $20. Now, the first thing I did show on my last video, um, but just in case if you didn't see that, I got this for my time. They had Christmas stuff out, and it is Opus. Isn't, isn't he cute? So cute. My dad loves penguins, so this is this will be for him. I'm going to give it to him like as soon as I see him. Um, so this year, like hang it on a tree. So cute. And his little star says, L "Love, yeah, love you, Watts and." Watts, yeah, so cute. I love that. Um, heirloom collection, I don't think I've ever seen them, but yeah, I don't know if they're today. Oh, 1994, 1994, Toronto, Canada. <laughs> so that is awesome. That was so cute. That was only one of the ornaments that I liked, yeah, very cute. And before we get to the bags. I got something that probably won't be used in a few years, but I know when you go back to school shopping, this is a lot of money. Five star binder, um, double section, double zipper. Yeah, it's in really good condition. Oh, you got a zipper on the, on the front too. So I know that this is why it's like yeah, twenty dollars was really, really a steal of a price for everything. Uh, oh, cool. Folders. Folder section. Nice. Keep everything organized. Okay, yeah, so double. Double. For some reason, I was thinking there was a third. A third one. But no, double with the front. Um, so, yeah. Really nice. Like, look at that. Yeah. Oh, and, oh. Oh, yeah, another folder section. Gee. Oh, I like that. That is really good. Yeah. Nice. So that, and it's, it's in good condition, too. So that's um, a bonus. Like, these are always good to find thrifting yard ceiling because they're not cheap. You know, they're not. No. Okay, so let's get to this bag first this was the first one i spotted i have a bag of um, dvds also and she was like um what did she say oh she uh what she asked if um i collect them i'm like yeah yeah i do which i do i do but the ones that i don't want we resell um but yeah i do i do collect especially the vhs right and there's some dvds that i would want to keep um but yeah yeah i do collect them i do certain ones yeah but the ones i don't collect um we resell and i think uh, and i'm not sure we'll start off with uh, a nostalgic one i am not sure if I have this one, I might, I might, the Wild Thornberry, Berry's movie, oh my gosh, I really like, oh, classic, yeah, classic, so that one, I might have this one, I think I do, but I want to make sure first, um, this one will be for Poshmark, this one was at one time, 1999, uh, remembering Ellis Island, Every Man's Monument, um, so yeah, that one, and it's never been opened, it's sealed. Yeah, uh, yeah. so that one. 
happy for Poshmark. Um, Historic Scotland, Emperor Castle, the, oh, the official souvenir video. You know, might make you want to go to Scotland. <laughs> Beautiful country. And the Lakeland Collection. So, uh, free view mapping guide <laughs> with live video. So, there's that one. Those will be for Poshmark, these three anyways. Okay, and like set tapes. Oh, that's what does it. Oh, Anne Murray! Hey! Anne Murray, how are you doing? <laughs> Whose parents did not listen to Anne Murray? I think every everyone growing up in the 80s, 90s, like that's what he, parents listened to is Anne Murray. Uh, but no paper, no color. So this is, this, this is yeah, my first time seeing everything. Um, the solid gold collection. So we have side A, side B. <laughs> if you said that to a kid, they would be like, what? What do you mean side A, side B? <laughs> you know, they would have no clue. Uh, we have the four tops. Reach out, I'll be there. Uh, the Hollies, bus stop. Diana Ross and the Supremes. You can't hurry, love. Some really good ones on here. Yeah, so you got that one. Oh, it looks like well, we looks like we have a set. Oh, yes, we do. Oh my gosh, are they? Oh, they're numbered. Oh my gosh. Yes, we have a set. So I, I wonder if they're all here. Um, this is volume 11. Oh, I have two 15s. Two 15s. Okay. Um, interesting. Probably put them all together. Now, for us, like, what, um, we sell all whatnots, the DVDs and VHS and cassette tape CDs, because I sell pretty good over there. Okay, so, History of Rock and Roll. Um... Yeah, these would be these would be good to listen to. I don't have a cassette player though. Yeah, these would be so good to listen to. Okay, let's see. Sarah McLaughlin. Wow, solace. Wow. Oh, a mixtape. A mixtape. <laughs> Bruce Springsteen. Oh my gosh. Yeah, Bruce. Bruce Springsteen, that was funny. Oh my gosh. Look at that mixtape. That is awesome. I love that design. Oh my god. That, that just takes you back. Oh. Alright, well we have some more history of rock and roll. It looks like I wonder if these are number two. Yeah, that one's number three. So I'll have to see. What was this one? Number two. Okay. So we got number three. That one. And this one is number four. We'll probably put like um, all the rock and roll ones together. There might be some missing. <laughs> oh, Titanic. Oh my gosh. Yeah. Oh, it's so funny. Oh, well. Oh my gosh. <laughs> that's just that. Oh, that's just, yeah, that's funny. <laughs> I remember when, when Titanic came out and like everybody was obsessed with it. You know, people still still are. Uh, but like when it came out, I was like that was like what everybody was talking about. You know, oh, did you go see the movie? Did you see the movie? And I remember seeing it in the movie one day after school on a Friday with my mom, mom and dad. Yeah, <laughs> that was a time to go um, to the movie theater was on a Friday after school because the movie theater was dead. You almost had the entire movie theater to yourself and that was like the best. All right, so we have another solid gold. That's number 16. This one's number 13. So they're not all there, but that's, that's fine. We'll just put them all together. And we have another mixed tape. There we go. Okay. Mixed tape. Um, oh, I love this. Oh, I just, I love the, the design. I love that. Um, I don't know if I can read that. Yeah. Zoom ins. Yeah, I don't know. 
I always want to listen to the mixtapes here. I, I need to find a cassette player. And Elton John. Let's see. Um, volume 3. 1979 to 1987. I guess that's why they call it the blues. Mama Can't Buy You Love. Um, I'm Still Standing. Classic. Yeah. So, that one. Yeah, and that's that's it. Did I show these ones? I don't know. Just a couple more of them. History of Rock and Roll. So, yeah. That was fun. Okay. I'll just get those all in. The VHS. I'm just going to put them. There we go. Perfect. Okay. Now. Oof. DVDs. Let's do a switcheroo. You go on the floor. Okay, I did find a couple of books, and this was a Indigo book. Yeah. Oh, it's a Reese's Book Club. I didn't know it's that. Um, it's Heather's Pick, The Paper Palace. So this one looks really good. Um, and there, there were, I think, like three boxes of books, and guess who I saw? He's stalking me everywhere I go. James Patterson. Like, go away. <laughs> like, that's how you know that, you know, he's just, there's too many of them. Because you see them everywhere, you know. It's like, oh. So this house, this place, knows all my secrets. Ooh, dun, dun, dun. So yeah, this one does look like a little bit of the Gummis tree. Um, yeah, and... So, decades of family legacies, love, lies, secrets, and one unspeakable childhood incident. Ooh. Life changing decision. Ooh. So, yeah, that looks good. <laughs> and it looks like it's been read once, probably. So, and this is really good find. Really good. The complete book of small batch preserving. Um, I do hope one day, I don't, I don't know when, I've been wanting to for the past couple of years to get into preserving food, just doing certain ones, um, and this will be great help when I do, you know, I have started a little bit, a little bit I have, but, um, I want to, like, jump into, into the pool, you know, um, <laughs> With my safety, with my safety, you know, my safety vest. Yeah, jump into the pool. Um, my floating vest. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I, this is this. This was a good price. Like, I'm curious to what it was. Um, original. I'll have to look, look it up. But yeah, 2013. So not too long ago, second edition. Yeah. Yeah. So that would be really good to flip through. And oh, pickle perfect, pickle perfection. Yes, pickle, pickle, we love pickles. So, yeah, that was that's why it's like, oh my gosh, like this was like probably over 20 bucks at least, if not more. So that's why it's like 20 bucks, everything. Yeah, that's a start the car, you know. Yeah, <laughs> run. <laughs> okay, so for the DVDs, a lot of this is gonna be first time looking. Oh my gosh, and this is a good way to start. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. <laughs> Okay, this is, gonna be, this is gonna be fun. Okay, um, we have, yeah, they're all there. We have, do you mind? Like, rude. Warner Brothers Home Entertainment Academy Awards Animation Collection. We got Looney Tunes. Oh, look at it. There's Pepe Le Pew. You know, people tried to cancel, and it's like, no, we don't cancel Pepe Le Pew. No. Like, it's, mm, it's ridiculous. I didn't agree with that, you know, cancellation. You know, it's like, no. Pepe Le Pew is here to stay. You can't just erase him from history. Like, seriously. Yeah, so, okay, that's going to be fun. We, we might keep that to watch. Yeah. <laughs> oh, there's Speedy. Speedy Gonzalez. <laughs> that's, that's what my sisters would call me because back at home growing up on the homestead, when they would cut the grass on the riding lawnmower because we had, like, all this open field. I would put the lawnmower at like number six, the highest speed, and I'd go zip, zip, zip. And then she would call me Speedy Gonzalez because I would have that grass cut in no time. Yeah, okay, so what made me laugh is Shirley Temple. Shirley Temple. 
yeah. <laughs> you know, my mom used to like her and had the DVDs, and I think she had the VHS tapes. I don't think she still does, um, but she did. The, she just doesn't watch it anymore. Um, <laughs> but, so that's why that made me laugh. That just brought back those those memories. Um, Timeless Adventures from Hollywood's Golden Age. You get three great movies: Heidi, Little Lord. Funchler Roy. I don't think I watched that one. I've watched Heidi and A Little Princess, which is my favorite. Probably my favorite. That may be Heidi, but The Little Princess was my favorite. And that got remade, and that was a good version, too. Uh, but I don't think I watched Little Lord Funchler Boy. No. Maybe. Maybe. Oh, Mickey Rooney. Oh, my gosh. No. Oh. Oh, that's special. Mm. Yeah, so, so. Um, Hugh Grant, I never watched this one. Sirens. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, I never watched that one. Australia in the 1930s, The Church is Shocked by Norman Lindsay, painting of, oh, a voluptuous naked woman on a cross. A young woman starring his wife, Estella, are dispatched to Lin Lindsay's country host to persuade him to withdraw the painting from coming exhibit exhibit I can't talk <laughs> exhibit issue <clears throat> they encounter yeah <clears throat> excuse me they encounter a bohemian household where the artist lives with his wife and three beautiful models and models entice Estelle into a world of sensuality which she has always suppressed like the models she is be gilded by a striking man who lives in the bush nearby. Estella is forced to explore her own sexuality and her new phone. Liberation threatens all that has come before. Yeah, this will probably be for This is not my kind of movie. This will be for, you know, to result. <laughs> but yeah, never heard of that one. And, um, <laughs> Dora the Explorer. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. There are people that, you know, like the old because she's been redone too. So, yeah. Um, Donkey X, I, I don't know, Shrek ripoff? It looks like a Shrek ripoff. Yeah. Oh, uh, Curious George, everyone's, you know, favorite mischievous monkey. My boys used to watch this, yeah. The oh, seventh season, the complete seventh season. Love that. Oh, speaking of Shrek, oh, Shrek 3, oh, 3D, the complete collection okay. now is that like 3d or is it like a blu-ray 3d collection okay so that probably won't play on our blu-ray i think you have to, don't you have that a special yeah okay yeah so check um oh rl stein's mostly ghostly have you met my ghoul ghoul friend that one um, the night before Christmas. <laughs> Rugrats the movie. I will probably be for sure, 100% be keeping this one. Um, I have it on VHS and now DVD. So yes, that's one I will be keeping. That is mine. And we have another Dora. And Elvis, his friend remembers. Well, all right. Anybody who is Elvis fan, um, Tom and Jerry, pause for a holiday. Cute. You get it? Pause. <laughs> oh my goodness! This is keeps. Oh my goodness! We I think we have that one. I'm pretty sure. Oh, oh my goodness! <laughs> <laughs> How many times can I say that? <laughs> um, Jumanji, which we have. The original. Another Dora. Monsters, Inc. Classic. Love it. I already have it, though, so we'll be selling that one. I have it both on DVD and VHS. Uh, another Dora. We'll probably put all the Doras together. Um, the complete first season of Break <laughs> Breaking Bad. <laughs> I 
to us all next time, the next DVD. Uh, that's a show I never watched, it never will, because it's not my kind of show. <laughs> yeah. Um, the one with all the weddings, friends, that's why, yeah. It's bringing back those memories, and uh, yeah, I wish he was still with us, Matthew Perry. Uh, which they are investigating. Yeah, they're, they're investigating his stuff. Yeah. Alright, um, Halloween Spongebob. I have to check. We might, might have this. I have to check. So this is going to be in the check pile. And, um, uh, so I know we do, but then I'm like, do I have it on VHS or DVD? Because everything is, like, um, put away because of the reno. So I have to, like, do a head count on my VHS and DVDs. So we might have this, but I'm not 100% sure. Princess Enchanted Tales, follow your dreams. Another classic, Madagascar. I have that one. And Village, no. Oh. Village of Spirits. Yeah. No, thank you. Yeah. Uh, another Dora. And last but not least. Oh, brand, oh I was going to say brand new. I look like I was brand new. Like, not open, but no, my eyes deceived me. <laughs> I'm seeing things. <laughs> um, Hello Kitty. Yeah, so that should do good. Hello Kitty, she does good. She got three movies. Hello Kitty goes to movies. Hello Kitty saves the day. And Hello Kitty plays pretend. So that is it. So yeah, really, really, really good. Um, yard sale haul. And whoops, there goes Tom and Jerry. <laughs> yeah, causing trouble. <laughs> yeah. Uh, okay, so let's put these back. And, yeah, that is it. That, that, that was exciting. I found a little bit of everything. Um, oh, I don't forgot, but I had to put Titanic back <laughs> in the bag. Okay. Alright, so I hope you enjoyed that. Um, I love this kind of yard sales, you know, and... They are fun. Charity art sales, you always find something. And you walk away with more than you, you expect it. Yeah, so. Alright guys, so that's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I really, really, really appreciate it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, be blessed, and ta-ta for now. Bye!